Hey everyone, it's Skills with your pregame walk and talk here in Greensboro as Kansas State is getting set for its first round matchup against Montana State here inside of Greensboro Coliseum on Friday night. No, I'm not inside right now. I took a step out here for just a minute to record this walk and talk is there's a little bit of noise in there. You know, every team's going through open practices today where fans can come in and see. So I decided to step out here and uh, talk some K-State hoops for just a few minutes. And cats are ready. You know, they got Montana State. It'll be one of the last games, if not the last game of the first round on Friday. And so this team's got some waiting to do. You know, Tang mentioned it on Selection Sunday when the team found out it's time that it would be playing right that you know getting that last game or not even the last game but just playing on Friday in general can be good for a team that is a higher seed right to not get upset or or maybe lock in you know a little bit more and and focus and, and be put on alert with other teams getting upset in the first round on the first day you know I saw Virginia as I was watching on the Jumbotron they had some games going inside the Coliseum we saw Virginia lose on a buzzer beater or not a buzzer beater but on the last few seconds of the game right and by the time this video is going live there's there's probably been a couple other buzzer beaters or, or something crazy going on in these games as as march madness always tends to have some surprises but uh k-state uh there's not a whole lot to to really report on you know the the open practice was pretty much just a glorified shoot around for the cats and you know we talked to the players in the locker room and I think they're they're focused, they're locked in. At the same time though, I feel like they're very calm and relaxed and they're not too anxious about playing in the NCAA tournament. You know, this team is full of guys that are, are from New York and for them to go to, you know, their home area, for Marquise Noel and Ish Masood and, you know, Tyke Green, for Naquan Tom and all those guys to go back and, and play in Madison Square Garden would mean the world to them without a doubt but to get there you have to beat Montana State and then to get there really you got to beat Providence or Kentucky in the second round of the NCAA tournament and I think that this team gets that you know Marquise Noel was asked about playing in New York and what that would mean and of course he answered the question but I think if if that wasn't asked to him playing in New York wouldn't be on his mind. Obviously, it's caught you know his attention that that's where the, the next destination would be for this team, but I think that this team truly is, is locked in on Montana State, and Jerome Tang has, has mentioned how playing in the first game of any tournament, you know, when K-State was playing in the Cayman Islands, Big 12 tournament, now NCAA tournament, time and again, Tang has mentioned how that first game is the toughest to win. After that, things don't necessarily get easier it just doesn't get any harder for for k-state to win in march and so they're locked in on montana state i think if you've been keeping up to date on go power cat throughout the week you've gotten a good idea of of what to expect from k-state's opponent so i'm not going to go through and and break down everything you should be be looking out for but you can bet your bottom dollar k-state has done its thorough scouting on Montana State and you know they're in the NCAA tournament for a reason right winning a conference is is not easy winning a conference tournament I guess I guess I should say is is not easy so K-State's locked in here and they need business to get to the final four you got to win four games and to get to New York you got to win two games to to get to face Providence or Kentucky in the second round you've you've got to win one game right I think that's how this team is kind of approaching things and they're taking it one game at a time as Kansas State will be facing off with Montana State here inside of Greensboro Coliseum on Friday night be sure to lock in on go power cat for all the coverage here in Greensboro as the journey has started for Kansas State